I did a gig at Leighton Live in Edinburgh that is renowned to this day as one of the most insane deaths anyone had ever seen. And I remember eight years after I did that gig, I was back in Edinburgh and I read an interview in the paper with a comic called Marcus Bridgestock. And they said to him, what are your three most memorable moments in Edinburgh over the last 20 years? And number two was that gig that I had the death. And what it was, I went out, I'd been hanging with Boothby and all these you know, comics and we were, you know, partying and taking cocaine and drinking, you know, straight spirits and I had this late gig at Late and Live and I started to think I was brilliant again and I just went out and started talking rubbish and the audience, you know, renowned for being a really tough audience at Late and Live, they all started just going, fuck off, fuck off. And I don't mean most of the audience, like everyone was doing it. Like by the end, by, after about five minutes, the entire room was just going, fuck off. And I ended up saying to the audience, all right, I'll leave if you're completely silent. So they did it. They all just shut up and they're all sitting there silently. And I'd go to walk off and just as I was about to leave, someone would go, you fucking cock. And I'd come back and I'd go, you ruined it for everyone, man. Now I'm staying for longer. And like this went on and you know, for ages it was the most excruciating. And the whole time I'm trying to act like, you know, <laughs> fuck, I don't care. But of course inside I'm just going, I just want them to like me. And uh, I remember looking over at some stage after about 15 minutes of this and Boothby or someone was on the side of the stage just going, come on, like, yeah, come on it's okay. <laughs> it was just, it was horrendous. But